Amazing Love. Welcome, viewers, to the third segment of the program, Amazing Love, where we are talking to two beautiful ladies who have just been telling us the amazing transformation that has been brought by in their lives through the hand of Prophetess Ruth Makandiwa. Before we went for the break, you were telling us what you went through and how desperate your situations became. But thank God for Prophetess Ruth Makandiwa, your lives have changed. Can you tell us now, after you met the Prophetess, how did she transform your life? After I met Prophetess Ruth Makandiwa, uh, she started paying for my rent, uh, started paying for my school fee school fees for my kids, and then uh, also giving me food stuff to eat. The burden that I had it was over. I was just uh, now living happily, just knowing that every month I'll get some rent from Mama. Uh, fees for my kids, food stuff and everything. And that thing of go me going back to beer or to nightclubs, that the, the, mo the, 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 the day when I said my, I wanted to change my life, and that was the change for good. I never even went back. I started saying, ah, but where were all these things from? But now, you can see I'm even living happily. Even my kids they, at school, they started performing very well. I had time with my kids nowadays. I can stay with them, chatting with them. The things that I didn't even do at that time. And I'm even living happily. I can even smile. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us, when you went to the prophetess, you explained the circumstances of your life, how you were living, the life that you had. What was the reaction? Did she not say with the type of lifestyle that you had, what was her reaction to, to the story that you told her? When I told the, the story, my story, I thought that maybe she would react. But she said, no, don't worry, my daughter. Don't worry. You've come to the right hands. I will take care of you as my own daughter. Don't even think of going back. Just to look forward and see what the, what the Lord is going to do to you. And, and how did it feel? What was, what was the experience like now having someone to turn to? I felt relieved. Even that burden of saying that me, I'm just alone in my family, all that never even came back, back to my mind again. I was just so relieved to say, I can live this life, me. Not even to warn myself, say, oh, it's now seven o'clock. It's time for me to go to be a war, to look for some money, you know. I can just go to Mama and ask her any time. Said you are comfortable to come and tell, tell me whatever that you are going through. Didn't she give you a grace period that I'll take care of you for such and such a time, or I'll take care of you, you bring back my money? What, what was the arrangement like? No, she said she will help me as a daughter, as, as her own daughter. That is what she said. She didn't even give me any condition. She gave me unconditional love. That is what she gave me wow. up to now. Wow. I don't even know how, how, how to explain it, the love that I got from Mama Ruth Makandio. Hmm, amazing. My sister, tell us, after you met the prophetess, she started helping you. What type of help did she extend to your life? food and clothes for me and my kids. So for that time, I'm going to get a bed and a twenty bed and Bamanga twenty six Sakawanda and a twenty my dinner plates, my two sets, Sakawandis, as Rumbamango, because of Prophetess Ruth Macandio. So tell me what your life is like now comparing to what it was before you met the Prophetess. As a young physician, I don't go change. And I don't go of any Sunday to his sisters, I do change. But see, Chandagan go out in my panning watch you can do my clubs and go down what he Satan and look at the beauty. But for now, 
you're explaining to us all this, but for somebody who's watching the program, they would want to know the impact of the love of the prophetess in your life. How did you feel when she showed you love? I don't go to the prophetess with Makandiwa Amazing, love indeed. My sister, can you tell us now, you were telling us your life has now changed, you now have time with your kids. We want to hear about this love, love of the prophetess, how it, how, how it has transformed your life. It's even difficult for me to explain the love of Mama Ruth Makandiwa. She's like a mother, like a sister, or I don't even know how, to, how the best way that I can explain the love that I get from Mama. If I'm telling you that she's paying the fees for my daughter, it's not for $10, but she's paying almost 500 and something dollars. And she's paying my rent. I now stay in a two-roomed house. For food, I can't even tell you. I get everything that I need. I'm now relaxed. I just want to thank God for Mama. Apart from the assistance that you're getting from the prophetess, what form of encouragement has she placed in your life that has seen you also want to do something for yourself? Mama Ruth Makandewa, she, she encouraged us to start some projects. And then I thought of doing something. And then I said I can start selling jewelry. I go to Zambia. I go, I buy some earrings, necklace, and I'm selling those necklaces. That is the project that I'm doing. Three quarters of the ladies in UFI, they wear my chains and my earrings. So now you're a businesswoman. Yeah. You actually travel outside the country. Yeah. <laughs> wow. What an amazing difference. So how does that make you feel from prostitution to being a business person? I'm relieved and I'm even happy just uh, that I'm using my own hands rather than for me to use my body to earn a living. Using a body for you to earn a living, it's a difficult thing. It's only that you had, I had no choice at that time. But now that I, I got a mother who cares about me and I can now use my own hands to survive, I'm, I'm happy. I don't even have any complaint. But only what I, what I can only say is the love of mom. I've never seen that love from anyone. And I also want to thank you so much for the love that she gave me. My sister, can you tell us now you, are, you now have your own bed, your own tea sets, your dinner plates. What else, what else is going on in your life because of the prophetess? business telling me that you are now a business owner as well you make your own budgets, you, you plan, you, you don't have to, to struggle to make money. Yeah. Wow, that is an amazing transformation, all because of the love of the prophetess. Yes. 
Hii ni kuda utenda utumwari nga wedri makura yaka wanda pana profe ni makandi wana profe tesuru. Tine rudora wa aliku tichiru wa shitubati sila. Kapitu ndutu mbufunga the wedge room bebo roti mwara eti. Ndutumwari we nirira ni shirika wati. Bati mwari waka kwa soti. Waka sunote ya wago ni kuburu kaife ni wega wa shikuwa saku utipa suni. Bati wakati tumira profe tesuru. Tuma kandi wana profe ni makandi. So kwa nguwe tendu onya shedu. So chungwe tingwari nga wawe zi ruma suwa. Chua tenda wati profe tesuru. Rudora wana rati suti waka bebe. My sister. Compare love with anything else that you can compare with in the world. What would you say about this amazing love? I don't even know the best word that I can use. I'm tongue-tied it. But all I can say is thank you, Mama, so much for changing my life. Thank you so much. May the God keep you. And also thank your Father. Prophet Emmanuel Makandio for changing my life. An amazing story, truly inspirational. It only goes on to show you what impact amazing love can have on anybody's life. Thank you for being with us on the program. Till we meet again in the next program, Amazing Love. Stay blessed. Amazing love.